Proctor boxer Amy Lemonator's last fight was with Nova Scotia's Taylor Ross. This is how it started. It ended with a split decision victory. Where did that come from? Uh, my coach calls it the pterodactyl. I have to kind of grow up, become more of a adult boxer instead of a child brawler. For the rematch in Nova Scotia, she's changing her fighting style. I hit with everything I have, and I'm not really focused on dodging punches. I just kind of walk straight forward. I think this girl's going to be ready for Amy to come out and brawl, and if she utilizes her boxing skills, I'll co I'm confident she'll do very well. She's usually the most defensive when playing goalie for the Proctor Hermantown Mirage. She'll be taking that mindset into the ring. I mean, whenever you make a mistake, it shows up on the scoreboard. Everybody sees it. Whether you're in between the pipes or in between the ropes, it's all about timing, anticipation, and action. Lemonager teaches kids' classes at Lorenzi's gym, so she has to practice what she preaches. And those kids see that when they come to the matches and they see her fire and determination. Guess who she looks up to? Ronda Rousey. I mean, I feel like I'm following her. She's definitely a role model of mine. Which explains her game plan. Not giving it her all or everything she's got in there is just not even an option for her. I plan on going to Nova Scotia and showing her that I'm not Minnesota nice. Rumble, young lady, rumble. In Proctor, Norman Seawright, KBJR6 and Range 11 Sports.